my, how lewd. <laughs> Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to Valkyrie Chronicles 4 after a few days and the ending of the game, which, uh... You should probably see first before watching any of these post-game streams, just for the uh, context, I guess. But, uh, yeah, welcome back. How's everyone doing? Happy Wednesday. Happy... <laughs> a very cold Wednesday for many people here in the US, at least. Um, did you know that... Despite being so cold here in the, uh, I, I guess the East and the uh, Midwest, um, it in fact was warm enough in Alaska for them to cancel like a sled race, race or something. So imagine that. It's it's freaking. I, I think it's warmer in Alaska than here, or uh, like somewhere near the North or the Midwest. It's it's kind of crazy. You watch the vods button, yeah. <laughs> oh man. But, um, hopefully the post-game here should, uh, lift our spirits, you know? You know, we, we finished the lore, there's a bit of a ceasefire, and we're gonna have a bit of a, um, a steamy ceasefire, which is the, uh, extra story we unlocked with our renown points. So this should be interesting. There's a lot of post-game stuff I have to get to for this game. Um, one being that steamy ceasefire interlude thing, and... There's two DLCs I need to play, and there's a whole bunch of squad stories I need to, I need to play through as well, as well, as well as unlock, even. So, I need to make sure I unlock those before the next few streams of this, definitely. Because I do want to play through all, all of the content of this game, at least as much as I can. So, yeah, uh, let's get started as the song ends here. There we go. Ooh, nice photon. Nice. Okay, so also Smash reminded me that the Piranha Plant Boy came out yesterday. Had a lot of fun testing him out. Very unpredictable character. There's a lot of like sneaky stuff you can do with him, which makes him pretty fun. What's up, Sibi? How you doing? Yes, homework is important. <laughs> Most of it, at least. But um, the grades are important, at least for a while. So keep at it. Persevere. Hey, let's watch the intro again, why not? Nice, Sibby. Get Coz. Hope you've been enjoying- Hope everyone's been enjoying uh, Kingdom Hearts 3 as well, if you've been playing or watching that. I think I'm gonna be watching um, Lime's playthrough on a Friday. I think she's gonna start it then. <laughs> Plant Boy is a very good boy, yeah. All these people in the intro, too, are very good boys and girls. Very good. Ah, Crimea. Ah, Belgar, you're dead. You two are dead, too. You're dead as well. <laughs> Walls is not dead, thank God. Wallace is enjoying life of Crimea. I'm happy for them. What's up, Q? How you doing?
God, this already brings back memories. This was such a good playthrough. Just the story of this. Ah, rise, no! That cutscene uh, means a lot more now. Holy crap. That just one scene of him walking through the damn snow. Holy crap. Alright. So, I did play through the first, um, I do want to start off this. I did play through the first hard skirmish of this game. Managed to A rank it after a few times. It was freaking hard though. It was really hard because it just throws enemies that are even better than elites at you. They're called, um, I have to remember the name, but... They're better than elites, and they just destroy you, pretty much. Hey, Nat, thanks for the resub. 17 months. Thank you. How you doing? Okay, um... But we did unlock a new squad member, so I'm gonna go, go back to headquarters, and, uh... Actually change out a few members of the squad, just to, um... You know, get us to meet some new people, you know? So... Let's go here. Okay, let's see. The fresh... So for completing the first hard, um, the first hard skirmish, we got Ben here, who looks like he has some, like, robotic parts. <laughs> He's got, like, half of, like, a face graph, too, there. <laughs> and the, uh, elite classes are paragons, the ones that are better than elites. That's what I've upgraded to. <laughs> He's a zombie, yeah. But yeah, I do want to switch out a few people, so, um... <laughs> Get out. Right. Uh, get out. Maybe a fatal Actually, no. Odin, you stay for now. Hold on. <laughs> this is the elimination round. The battlefield calls to me. The battlefield. I'll hold the fort. Get out here, Stanley. Oh, heck, really? Uh, Vanti, you're staying. Boring. Ferrier, you're staying. Uh, Lily, you're staying. Mm. Get out. Um, hmm. Valkyria Battle Royale, yeah. How many engineers do I have? I might just switch out all of these guys. Okay, I have one more. So... Uh, we'll switch out... Um, Rebecca with Alward. Switch you out. We still have stuff to do with Aladdin, I think. Let's get in... Um, I haven't used Nord yet. He looks pretty interesting. He's a friend to animals and has that little like bear thing on his hat. What's up, Ant? How you doing? Hope you enjoy your, uh, whatever you're doing. Ooh, nice, Nat. Good luck with that. If you want. And what about Leonhardt? How about, how about him? Or Mabel? We haven't used a lot of these snipers. I'm surprised. Unfortunate. Let me actually switch out Aladdin. Um, I want to get these two in. Naturally. Moving out. And for our Grenadiers, uh, these two can... I think Connor can go. Uh, we did a squad story. Let's get the new guy in. Ben. All right. And we have a lot of slots open, so... Uh, Joshua, you come in too. Oh, thank you for watching, Photon. Thank you. Who's the scouts haven't we, um, seen? Azusa, you look interesting. She's the stealth, uh, scout, I think. Yeah, night vision, stealth expertise. Drunk on pheromones. Being next to a man gets her drunk on pheromones, lowering her, lowering her, dis her defense. And something to hide, interestingly enough. There's blood in the air. There's blood in the air. What's up, women? How you doing? The non-Kai snipers feel kind of superfluous. Yeah. Scouts are like the class you need the least of, really. Who the hell is this? Simon? He's a bully. A weak constitution, battle with women, and a loose cannon. Wow. Okay, we'll keep him <laughs> we'll keep him in the squad, I think. Uh and we'll also get, let's see. How's our composition doing here? Yo, let's get a Lancer. Um Let's see here. Sounds like a real charmer, yeah. Hannah, who is gutsy? 
a loud mouth, but an ace chef, which somehow increases her attack power. I guess it's the, guess it's the magic of anime cooking, you know? So let's get her in. Nice. Okay. Cool. 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 Um, can we Nico as our de facto uh, leader? Of course. I don't think that's gonna change. So. There. All set for the next battle. Okay. I did a bunch of um, R&D and training stuff before, uh, so we'll head back to the book. And let's start this uh, interlude, I think. This steamy ceasefire sort of thing. Whatever this is, even. I don't even know. I mean, I'm assuming it's like a hot spring thing, so let's see here. Interlude. A steamy ceasefire. A steamy ceasefire. So this seems to happen right after um, we get introduced to EXO and right after we get onto the Centurion. So let's see what happens here. Oh boy. The first uh, sequence's title is a good, good boy. Oh no. Oh, this boy. Okay, okay. He's a good boy. Rags is a good boy. Easy, Rags. It's not even mealtime. Oh, wait. It's later than I thought. Big one. That's odd. It's been hours since Claude left on recon. He and the others should have been back a long time ago. <sighs> you worried too, boy? Loyal pupper. The lizard's getting pretty bad. I hope they're okay. Where did they go? Where did they even go? Try again, Marie. Any word from Claude? Nothing. The storm brought all communications down. I knew reconnaissance in this weather was a bad idea. What are you reconning any exactly? Just out in the freaking ocean somewhere? But we couldn't ignore that report. If there's even a chance the enemy is planning an ambush. No, I guess we're near land or something, yeah. We really have no choice but to confirm. In these temperatures, even the antifreeze will freeze over. I'm afraid I can't order a search party. Reconning for fish, yes. Delicious if they fish. Don't return soon. We'll have to depart without them. No. How long will this damn blizzard last? You'd better get back here alive, Claude. Are they not freezing to death? I think we'll find out soon. <laughs> we'll find out for sure. Keep it together. We stop now and we're all dead. Well, Riley fell into the lake. She's dead. Leave her behind. I'm well aware of that. Damn it. Snow's coming down so hard, every step is like sinking in quicksand. Not to mention these winds. Just trying to stand straight is like fighting against a tide. It's do or die, everyone. Just a little further. We won't make it much longer. This blizzard's got a couple hours left in it. We have to find cover, or else. Time to eat some of that um beef jerky that Raz kept in his uh in his pants, apparently. What? Uh. Enemy soldiers, twelve o'clock. Are those the imps laying an ambush for us? No. Judging from the rank and file, they're probably a recon team like us. I'd rather not engage in these conditions, but. Whoa. Guess we don't have much choice. We're actually fighting? Okay. Okay, I guess we're not actually fighting, but uh... I thought I was gonna have a combat sequence there. Guess not, though. This is pointless. The shots won't reach them. <laughs> so much for Dead Eye Kai. 
Why is the leaders? Why are the leaders, first of all, of Squad E doing a recon mission? Because they do everything, apparently, on this damn ship. I don't know. And my grenades are frozen stuck. I can't fire anything. Stay calm. The enemy's just as handicapped as we are. I don't think either side can engage, to be honest. Sit down and eat some snow cones. Uh, kind of late to get cold feet. Besides, they're just grunts. Leave it to the invincible Raz. Wait. Can't miss it point blank. Eat lead. Huh? Hey, what the? <laughs> Did he jam? Of course. <laughs> get a load of this filthy Darkson. His barrel's frozen over. The dumbass. All right, we can kill this Lancer though. Sure. Well, well. Seems Federation gear can't handle the cold. Raz, retreat! <laughs> Too late! You're dead! Huh? Ha! Got him. Uh, looks like our guns froze over too. Time for a fist fight! <laughs> hey, Kazi, thanks for the host. Let's give you a shout out there. Oh, uh, do these? I still need to set up those notifications for you, Nat. The uh, the chat notifications. I'll do that right after stream. I've waited too long on that, so give me a sec to write that down. Uh, host notifications. There we go. God damn piece of scrap metal! Ah! Holy crap! He just threw that machine gun one-handed. Those things weigh a ton. Yeah, so what? I've got a heavy machine gun! You think the men of the North will lose to a bunch of pansies who prance around with girls? Wow. Kai's gonna beat your ass, man. So what if I'm female, you knuckle-dragging grunt? I am a lieutenant, and more woman than you can handle! Are they just, like, throwing you their weapons? Like What's happening here? On you? Then first you'll have to prove you're stronger than me. Rah! Crap! We're out of stuff to throw. <laughs> throw a grenade. There we go. Then we go for close quarters combat. Oh yeah? Put up your dukes. <sighs> now they're throwing punches. Give me a break. That's enough, all of you. Huh? Everyone, stop it! What? It was just getting to the good part. I take it you're in command here? Yes. Looks like we both got lost scouting the area. Yeah. We're in a real jam, truth be told. The weapons don't work, as you can see, and our winter gear won't last. We were just looking for a place to wait out the blizzard ourselves. Now, we're completely lost. Oh, so... <laughs> this is, uh... This is Midwest Weather Simulator right now, huh? How topical. We both need all the help we can get. Agreed. Let's call a ceasefire for now. Don't freeze, by the way. Stay warm. shivering you die stay moving to keep your body heat up i don't need advice from the likes of you and don't walk over the fresh fallen snow step in our tracks to make it easier on you oh how nice don't be stubborn it's life or death here B fine i get our guns crapping out but shouldn't yours be built for this kind of thing look this is way colder than a normal Imperial winter. And even if our gear worked, we couldn't hit the broadside of a bunker in this blizzard. Excuses, excuses. At least the part about missing is true. <laughs> Overconfidence, man. Come on. You couldn't fire a single shot, you filthy Darkson. Okay, sure. And who's the bozo who couldn't shoot a Darkson? 
I envy those clowns. Do they ever run out of steam? How dare he fraternize with the enemy? Emergency or no, the sight of it makes me sick. Does that look like fraternizing to you? What else would you call it? Mm -hmm. So this is the real Winter Witch. Yes. I'm surprised you've heard that old folk tale. The blizzard's so cold, our ancestors called it black magic. Pretty terrifying when you think about it. This is the only Imperial with a beard. Well, I guess because, besides, uh... I guess besides walls. Yeah. And there's two hours to go. How can you tell? Call it a hunch. I've got a knack for picking up changes in the weather. But if we hadn't come across you, we'd be dead in the snow. The Winter Witch's latest victims. Just having extra bodies to block the wind is a lifesaver. And by the looks of it, your men took the windward side. I appreciate that. No thanks needed. Chivalry isn't completely dead. I have to say, I'm glad our weapons malfunctioned. And we were this close to outright killing each other. We may have lost our bread and salt, but at least we have our vodka. Our vodka. So this is the, um... I guess this interlude is the... You know, the, the two sides sort of... Meet up and agree to, you know, just, just be cool for a bit. Something like that happened in the first game, too. Old Imperial saying, like you say in the West, every cloud has a silver lining. Feels strange breaking bread when moments ago we were staring down each other's barrels. Guess I'll have to count my blessings. Hmm? The blizzard should be dying down soon. There's one more blessing to count. Now we can start shooting each other. <laughs> Blizzards died down, but I'm still freezing my balls off. Surrounded by so much white, it's hard to tell if we're even moving forward. <laughs> hey, Claude. Why doesn't that area have any snow? Uh-oh. Huh, you're right. Those rocks over there aren't covered at all. Uh-oh. Oh, could it be? Hmm. What's the matter? I need help over here. Come on, gather round. So, Claude, what's so special about these rocks? Can't you tell? The snow is being melted from beneath. Ah, of course. That means... Do you have any explosives? We have grenades, but the pins are frozen stuck. Let me see them. But sir, we need them in case of an emergency. That's what this is, and it wasn't a question. Hand them over. I need my uh, hot baths, you know? That's an emergency. Uh, yes, sir. Squatty, take out all the grenades and explosives you have. Riley, set them up to make as big a blast as possible. Um, Claude? An explosion won't keep us warm for long. If we want a fire, we need fuel first. Yeah, Riley, we're gonna blow our like limbs off just to keep ourselves warm. That's definitely what's happening here. Don't worry. Center it on the crevice over there. Please, trust me on this. I don't get what you're going for, but if you insist, I'll wave my magic wand and grant your wish. All right, I'm gonna ignite it. Take cover. What's up, Aether? How you doing? How does, it, how does it even work? Is there like a volcano under this area? Just like geothermal uh, vents and stuff, yeah. Slash volcanoes. Is that a hot spring? This geothermal groundwater melting the snow. Amazing! Oh, the temperature's perfect. Oh boy, here we go. Oh gosh. <laughs> <laughs> yes! Take that, Winter Witch! gonna make it where's Nico keep her away from the screen oh hell yeah without further ado I'll take first dibs and hold it huh ladies first 
Do you really expect me to just sit here and wait? Yes. What's wrong with you, Federation soldiers? <laughs> More like what's wrong with Squad E. Not all the Federations like this, trust me. Where's your manners, man? <laughs> this guy couldn't get a girl of his life to oh! <laughs> Man. Man. That's, that's, uh... That kind of hurts, man. Considering other things, you know. No objections here. Women first. Goddamn imps. We'll take you up on that offer. If you'll excuse us, then. Hell half no fury. What the heck? What is going on here? Is, is, this, is this just gonna be arguing? Freeze! So long as I draw breath. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Minerva, aren't you gonna join him? Of course. I'm standing watch. Can't drop our guards around these Imperials after all. Ah, oh, don't get your panties in a bunch. You wish we were that desperate to see your tits defrosting. Wow, okay, okay, man. That's quite the phrase there, Raz. That is quite the phrase. Excuse me? So, uh, are all Federation women like this? <laughs> I'd say they're exceptions to the rule. Oh, yeah. Yeah, they definitely are. Boy, are they aggressive. Ladies first my ass. Seriously, they're rougher and tougher than any man I know. They'll kick your butt. That's what I know. But let me tell you, gal's back in the motherland. Modesty's actually a virtue for them. Always there for her man, but never overstepping her bounds. Now that's a girl worth fighting for. Heh. <laughs> Show this pigs. What did you call us? You're so hung up on your Madonna whore complex, you don't even care that your government is oppressing all its people. What kind of conversation is this? What is happening? <laughs> Minerva, what are you doing? Quiet, you harlot! The Empire's traditional values are what keep it prospering. Unlike you Federation degenerates. Values? Is that what you call violence and oppression? Oh, that's rich coming from a Fed. Or are you too busy painting your nails to see what's going on in your own colonies? Oh boy, here we go again. Here we go. Come again? Need I remind you who started this war in the first place? It's that murderous tyrant you call an emperor! And here you are, trying to lecture me. <laughs> You're beyond help. Oh, would you shut up already? Women shouldn't butt their pretty little heads into politics to begin with. Okay, then. All right. <laughs> what? This is what happens when females are allowed on the battlefield. All right. Um, Minerva, I think you've got your job to do here. I'll let you do it. That's right. A woman's place is at home, a man's at war. Oh, my God. So get back to the kitchen and oh make my, us a sandwich. Oh, my God. They, they literally just, like, dropped that line, did they? <laughs> they? They literally dropped that line. <sighs> Uh, I, and you just, I, I, perf, you're the one 
standing there with your tits hanging out. Federation women are so different. You shut your mouth! Turn away! Close your eyes! Forget everything you saw! <sighs> this is wonderful. God bless, Kai. God bless. <laughs> wow. Riley, you are crazy. You are, uh, you gotta have a bit more personal awareness. Let's just say that. Holy crap. <laughs> Looks like the blizzard's over. Like you said, two hours on the dot. Impressive. Communications are back up. We're gonna hunker down and wait for evac. We'll be gone by then. I'd rather not have to shoot you. Huh. Never expected you feds could be so... fun. Not to mention, that was one hell of a view. Oh my god. <laughs> god. <laughs> well, until we meet again. Next time, it'll be on the battlefield. Hey, you. Yeah? That rifle. You a sniper? I assume you are, too. I may not look it, but they call me Jedi. Quite a firearm there. I've never seen camel like that. Huh. Thanks. My wife designed it for me. I see. Just like she was supposed to, huh? The virtue of a modest female? I love her. And I'd like to think she did it because she loves me. I guess we're both fighting for someone we love. Yeah, Kai. Yeah. Can't save everyone. All we can do is hold on to the one thing that matters most and protect it with our lives. That's why we have no choice but to fight. <laughs> My commander told me that one. The one thing that matters most, huh? So if our paths ever cross again, may the best sniper win. Right back at you. See you on the field, Deadeye. You too. Godspeed, friend. That's sweet. That is good. A new sub episode has been added under the Northern Lights. Oh, okay. Where's that? Uh. Probably somewhere on the ice here. Uh, let's see. Is the end that like one section where there's an empty space? Let's see here. Well, I think oh, okay, here we go. Not that one back there, but there's something here as well. Okay. What's going on here? Oh, oops. Uh, there we go. Say, Riley, you want to go up on the deck with me? Ooh, romantic. Up top? The sun's already gone down. Won't it be cold? Yeah, that's why it's perfect timing. Come on. Don't don't let everyone don't let anyone see you two are going up by yourselves. Wow. This is amazing. Isn't this Aurora Borealis? That's right. It's an aurora. This is the first time I've ever seen one. I heard they're super rare, even this far north. Don't tell me the aurora talks to you too. You basically have to get lucky to catch one of these. There weren't any clouds today, and the sky's dark with the new moon out. All the conditions were right, so... So you did predict it. It's incredible. I never thought I'd live to see something like this. This is the first time for me, too. I guess we both got really lucky. Yeah. We've seen all kinds of miracles and good fortune out here. And losses. And bad luck, too. Don't do it, chat. But we made it this far. We got through all that. This is kind of familiar, huh? 
Like after the Star Child Festival, when we'd all look up at the night sky, together. Yeah. After you left Hoffen, the sky was all I saw for a long time. I made it out here, so... I must have turned my life around somehow. But sometimes... I wonder if I've really changed. <laughs> I forgive you. Aww. Finally we got resolution there, I think. What? I think you have. Changed, I mean. And if it's coming from me, you know it's gotta be true. Right? So I... I I, I think I might have noted that there was a bit of, um, a rapid, uh, how should I word this? Like, chilling of tensions between Riley and Claude at the start. I guess this is, this is what's gonna bridge it a bit. Yeah, you're right. So, I forgive you, okay? Thank you, Riley. But you're not off the hook yet. Once this war's over, you're going to help me start up my family's factory again. Of course. <laughs> With pleasure. You sure you're excited about it? You've got a whole lifetime of hard work ahead of you, mister. A lifetime? Yep. Oh, God. You'll be working for me until you're an old grandpa. Damn. She's got that contract written out already. Well, I... if that's what you want, then I'd be happy to. Huh? <laughs> well, I... Uh, I didn't mean anything weird by that. So... Uh, wow, it's really chilly. We should totally head inside. <sighs> Stay a little longer. It's almost ready. I promise you're gonna love it. Oh god, my eyes. <gasps> Pretty! Did you predict all this too? I learned to see a lot in the sky. My sorrow didn't give me much, but I did get this. It's not bad, as far as presents go. Right? Oh god, my heart. Yeah. I swear, we will live to see Hoffman again. We will. Together. Yeah. Together. Cute! Cute! Oh, oh no. Oh no. A new mission has been added to chapter 18. Select the final battle and choose which operation we should play. Oh, okay. Pledge of Courage has changed into Oral Val. I don't think I'm the same potential. Okay. The same potential! Now that's nice. I like that. I like the symbolism there. Uh, so, chapter 18, um, I, d <laughs> this one? W was it this one? Hold on. Because if, if we're playing the final battle again, I don't want to do it right now. I I'm going to do it, like, off stream and then see what happens, I think. Oh, hard, huh? Okay, um, I don't think I want to do that on stream. I'll, I'll play it off stream and then finish it on stream and then we'll see what happens afterwards. Yeah, that sounds good. All right, so I think that's all of the side stuff for the main story. So let's head to the DLC. Um, a Captainless Squad. This is the next one. So this is a purchasable DLC. Extra story. 
a captainless squad. Which appears to be um, the side character DLC that's in Thalassorv in the first game as well. And also, it also I think revolves around Ragnarok, the doggo here. So let's let's see what's going on here. Yeah, look, I'm, I think I'm gonna have to uh, grind up so everyone's like max level and then try that. Winter, 1935. Now that we're aboard the Centurion, Squad E doesn't need to set night watches in the freezing cold. After that grueling march in the snow, a few moments of peace and quiet is a welcome change for all of us. Mm, where could he be? Yay, Karen! Yay! Hello. Something the matter, Karen? I don't see you around here too often. Well, have you seen Rags? I mean, Ragnarok, recently? You better find that doggo, I swear. It's about time to switch out the Ragnade kid on his collar. I haven't seen him since this morning. Isn't he usually hanging around Riley or Kai? They're both on a recon mission with Raz and the Commander. They said they'd be out for a couple days at least. Oh, now that you mention it, I think Raz brought him up. Something about leaving me in charge of Rag's meals. Zyga? I, I, I think you fucked up, man. Wait. Are you telling me you completely forgot until now? It's been two whole days since they left. You're saying Rags hasn't had a bite to eat since then? What are you doing, man? <laughs> Why? Oh my god. Ah, crap. Guess I spaced out without Raz to remind me. Sorry, my bad. Oh no. I've been so busy with repairs, I didn't even notice poor Rags was starving. Feed him! Feed him! Yeah! Don't underestimate the nature of a beast. If he doesn't get fed, he'll find his own food. He's fine. Just let him follow his instincts. But it says, Zyga, you forgot to feed the boy. No wonder we sent him off to die. <laughs> Ooh, man. Ooh. Oh, man. Instincts, huh? I suppose. But how's he going to find prey to hunt aboard a snow cruiser? Are all the staff accounted for? Uh-oh. Let's assume you're right. What's Ragnarok's next move? Hmm. The answer is elementary. H hold up. You think he ran off the ship to look for food? I think it stands to reason. Besides, it'd certainly make an interesting plot twist. Elementary, my dear Watson. This is no joke, Connor. Ragnarok is a canine soldier. If he's caught deserting his post, he'll be euthanized. Oh god, they're gonna put him down and it's all my fault! No! No! Guys, you gotta help me find Rags. I can't let this happen. Rags! Come on, boy! Check it out, I've got some tasty meat for you! It still has the bone and everything! Yeah! Look at all this meat! <laughs> God damn, <laughs> it smells delish! So juicy and tender! Mm, 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 mm. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, I, th I think we're gonna we're gonna ha we're gonna enjoy having Simon in the squad for the post game here. Hey Simon! That food is for rags! D did he just eat it? Oh, <laughs> quite right. A thousand pardons, ma'am. Miss. Oh dear. This is going nowhere fast. Not a paw print to be seen. Crystal Sea is just too big. How are we supposed to even find his trail? Ragnarok's a smart dog. I'm sure he found something to eat, even in a frozen wasteland like this. You know, I'm, I'm kind of glad we have the um, squad stories in this game because. I was thinking, it's kind of impossible to, like, cycle through all of your soldiers. I mean, it's possible, but you kind of want to get to learn, you know, a lot of them, you know. And the squad stories are nice because you can just get one member 
of the squad story up to like corporal rank, I think, and unlock it, which lets you learn about the other ones. It's cool. It's cool. It's a good way to learn about everyone, even without having to use all of them, I guess. Well, I guess that means he would have headed for land. It's a hell of a walk, but we ought to check the islands. And then again, there are too many to just look randomly. We gotta at least figure out the direction he took. But we don't even have permission to disembark. And the commander's going to be back by nightfall. If we don't get Rags back by then, the captain's going to set sail without him. Little Button says if Rags is anything like her dog, he's going through the trash bin and snooping in the kitchen right now, not outside. <laughs> um, Azusa? Why are you sniffing around like that? So, yeah. Yeah. Rags is a, is a military doggo, though. He is, he is trained for this weather. It's basically his home. Look, I think there's animal fur over there. Animal fur? I don't see anything. Look a little closer. Oh, nice. Yes, I do suppose it looks like a strand of brownish hair. Nice catch, Azusa. The hair smells familiar and a little musky. It belongs to Rads, no doubt about it. What? How the hell can you pick up a scent just from that? My sense of smell is never wrong. The trail is heading westward. I should be able to track it. What the? Hey! You better be right about this. Azusa, have you been smelling rags in your spare time? That's kind of weird, man. If she is, her sense of smell might even be as good as a canine unit's. Say, that gives me an idea for a mystery novel. Nerd! Jeez, Connor, you've got nothing but books on the brain. Well, it's not like we've got any other leads. Let's trust Azusa and follow her. There he is! The black tank? Oh boy. Is that who I think it is? So, Rags' scent is coming from this direction. I'm positive. But, but there's a tank over there. It looks like Imperials are occupying this village. Yaha! Perfect! We'll just crush him as we roll on by! Don't be stupid. We're not equipped to take on a tank alone. What? I mean... We can. Actually, never mind. Claw's not here. Never mind. We, we can't... <laughs> we, we can't use water, so never mind. W whatever. Let's scope out the area first. Hey. You find it yet? I don't see it anywhere. Sneaky little bastard. What is? <laughs> oh, I guess they're looking for the dog. I was about, I was about to say, is Walls like doing a scavenger hunt or something? What's going on here? That goddamn mutt's got some nerve stealing meat from Ausbruch. Yeah, Ra <laughs> Rex stole their food. Yeah, exactly, Loresta. You guessed it. That was the last of our fresh rations. We're getting it back if we have to burn down this whole village. Huh? I think I see something. I'll smoke him out. Imagine getting defeated by, by, by just one doggo. One doggo. Whoa, don't... Don't, don't shoot the doggo, please. There! Open fire! Whoa, no, 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 no. That tank matches up with the one in my notes. It's the same one we faced at the Z-Fall line in Limburg base, which means the Imperial tank platoon isn't far off. Fighting them head on without Claude would be risky. And that's a major understatement. It's my fault Rags is in trouble. I'm not gonna let him die like this. I don't need Raz or Claude. I'll save him myself. Wow, that was actually pretty badass. I didn't think you had it in you. Not the time, Rita. Not the time. What the hell's that supposed to mean? Rex, over here. 
Come on, boy. Hurry! <coughs> Wait a minute! Federation scouts? We'll just kill the whole goddamn litter. Come on! Alright, time to beat up these nerds. I guess we're gonna get a uh, limited squad here, which will be interesting. Rax, we're gonna come get you, buddy. Alright. We're gonna be up against that squad with the black tank. I don't think we stand a chance against them with a head-on assault. We need to make some commotion and distract them. That should give Rags enough time to escape. He's a smart one, so I'm sure he'll be able to catch on to what we're doing. Okay, so none of our soldiers can die. Uh, let's see here. And they captured a base camp. Alright, simple enough. Uh, yes, just we have to deploy, deploy these eight folks. So... I wonder if I can assign one of them as a leader. But uh, we don't need that, I think. Alright, scouts Found in the front. Shock troopers right behind I them. Can't wait. Hmm. All right. Got to stay calm. Ready and waiting. Let's do this. I don't care if Raz and Claude aren't with us. We can still do this! Come on! Yeah, they should inherit their um, current levels, uh, which is level 22. So we should be pretty fine here. Listen, we'll have to fight without a commander. That means we need to cooperate. No boss! No problem! I'm just gonna do what I always do! <laughs> Whatever the hell I want! <laughs> oh my god, Simon! <laughs> Dude, this guy's amazing. This guy's amazing. I, 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 I'm gonna regret not putting these people in the squad earlier, aren't I? Damn it! We have to work together, you dingus. It's us against the Empire's most powerful tanks. Honestly, I'm terrified, but I'm excited too. I love all these folks. Holy crap! I love them all. I, I'm gonna do my best to protect Rex. Come on then. Let's go! God, the freaking characters are so good! They're so good in this game! They're so good! Alright, so what we got here? Uh, we do have one Lancer, which we should protect, because that's our only real anti-tank power here. Okay. Let's see here. So... Not that far of a distance to the base camp. I could scout rush, but that's not fun. So let's uh, take some of these guys out, shall we? Okay, so let me check if they're... Um, first of all, let me see if there's anything special. Okay, so we captured the enemy base and we secured an escape route. So there's two parts, it looks like. And we are level 22, so we are Paragons. That's good. All right. All right, plan of attack, plan of attack. So what we need to do first, where's my telestrator? Did I close it? God damn it, hold on. Did I close something or did I did it crash? I can never tell. Cause I don't, I don't think I closed it myself. All right, so this guy is a problem. This guy in itself, we gotta kill him. Hold on. Boom. There we go. We gotta kill this guy, so we might want to bring someone down there and then have him um, um, sweep back up afterwards to kill these folks. Lancer's gonna have to come around here, kill this tank. That should be easy enough. And then otherwise, I think we can send some people up this elevated area, take out whatever this is. I think it's a Gatling, probably. Yeah, heavy Gatling. And then keep going from there. Uh, probably send most people down this way, but might want to send someone else up this way because there's probably like an elite hiding up here somewhere. Let me check their names first of all, actually. Or a, uh, a named unit, rather. This sniper is going to be a pain. Uh, we're going to have to counter snipe him. And yeah, okay. 
So let's start off our southern operation here, which we'll probably want to send a scout to do. That should be fine. Mm -hmm. No problem. All right, let's go, Rosetta. Ooh, we actually can't go behind our uh, camp here, interestingly enough. So I'll have to take the uh, long way, the long way around, or something. Hmm. Oh, it can't go down either. Okay, that changes things. Interesting. Okay, then we probably want to snipe this uh, trooper back there. For now, though, what's a scallop? Ooh, hello. Ah, crappy engineer, huh? Let's see. That should be good. Here I go. I found you. All right. Uh, Gatling. There's a Gatling. There's another scout. <laughs> there's a scout on top of the uh, sniper towel for for whatever reason. All right. Let me actually um. Hmm. We just stay here. That should be fine. Okay. So the situation has changed a little bit hey. here. Looks like the enemy doesn't have a commander either. Their movements lack coordination. Exploit that, and we might just stand a chance. Correct, either. I am, um, I am well over post game. Uh, well, I, I'm in like post game uh, troop levels right now. So this should be this should be good. And now's the perfect time to run them down. I just gotta make sure my rear is not uh, exposed here. All right, this takes to be a problem then. I don't want anyone in this general area, probably. There's a tank here too, great. Okay. Um, hopefully Hannah can dish out some serious pain here. I'll knock him down. Okay, first of all, let's see the damage output here. Two shots, not bad, actually. The more serious threat is in front of us, though, so let's see if we can reach that. Not likely. Not likely, so let's uh, head into the grass here. I, I think my lances are max level. Um, there was a renowned upgrade that let me upgrade my weapons even more up to max level down the uh, RNG tree. So I know my rifles I think are max level and something else is as well. So what what is this guy doing here? There's gotta be like an elite back here or something. That's suspicious. I'll deal with the elites later. All right, this catling needs to die. Not a catling, a gatling. Here I come! <laughs> All right, calm down, Simon. It's just it's just one unit. Come on. Meat sacks. Meat sacks. <laughs> yeah, Simon's kind of crazy. <laughs> if you if you couldn't tell. Found you. Found you. Found you! I wonder how they chose the characters for this, uh, this DLC. Maybe they ran like a popularity poll or something. Ooh, units, huh? Mmm, spicy. Spicy. Uh, Connor, what do you have on you? Let's see. You've got the anti personnel Great. Perfect. Right. Right. Looks like my time to shine. I figured them out. All right, so where are those punks? There they are. Take aim. Beautiful. Beautiful. Oh, beautiful! Oh, anticlimactic. Beautiful. Okay, who else should we kill now?
Now this is the powers you get from being a nerd. Extra actions. Alright, let's kill... Um, let's see here. Scout. Sniper? No, we can't reach him. Who is this, though? Scout. Eh, get out of here. You'll have to go. You have been retconned. Okay. All right, Lancer. Yeah, yeah. Let's uh take out that tank there. Right, right. Wrong unit. <laughs> Wrong unit, but that's fine. We can adapt, no worries. I don't want to blow up this tower, but we've got an engineer anyway, so we can uh we can dish out some destruction here. There. Even if we did have another action, I ran out of ammo, so that wouldn't have really helped. All right, so now I'll knock him down. Knock him down, Hannah. All right, what we got here? A oh, beautiful tank here, huh? I'll tenderize ya. I'll tenderize ya. Yeah, she's a cook. Yeah. Hey, Zeal Emblem, how you doing? Welcome to the post game here. I could heal someone for disrespect, yes. Disrespect points. Don't miss. I'll ya. Oh, there's, <laughs> there's a Red Knight caster behind it. Alright, that's fine though. That works. Well, smart Imperials putting their tanks behind Red Knight canisters or in front of them. Very smart. Very, very smart. Okay, um... Uh, Nish, what can you do? What can you do? Yeah, I don't think you have sight of that enemy sniper. Yeah, you don't. Maybe you do. Uh, it's behind that wall, I think. Yeah. So, let's kill this trooper. I kind of miss Vancey's, uh, nice, after she kills someone. Nice. Right, what are you guys doing? There are some enemies back there. Niche can pop skulls and be cute. Those are good traits to have. And she portrays those perfectly. Okay. So that scout's coming up. Um, the long way it looks like. Okay. You! Whoa. <laughs> what, what are you doing? Don't you know about the sandbags, man? Don't you know? What, what did he, he just... He just stuck himself into enemy territory. All right, whatever. Okay, um, I'm tempted to just like rush a scout down there. But I do want to, um, here I come! take Simon along the back here. Not before I kill this guy first, though. Hold on. It was a worthy sacrifice, I think. He calls enemies meat sacks? Oh boy. Meat sacks. Oh, hello. Hello, 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 hello there. Ah, uh, good. We can, get, we can get the Grenadier too back here. That's good. 
Um, let's see here. Yeah, Shock Trooper is probably better for clearing these guys out right now. Afterwards, I can probably send a scout down there and finish this off pretty easily. You wanna go crazy, Simon? Here I come! Go crazy. Go absolutely insane right now. Bite my bullet! It's an advanced tactic, yeah, Zeno. It's a it's a galaxy brain tactic. Meat sacks. Can we get both of these guys? Let's see. Let's go to the lit right a bit here. A little bit more. Now that's spicy. Oh, he didn't die though, dang it. Weakling! Found you! Hi. Hi. Okay, we've got Lancers are more shock troopers here. Lots of units here. It'd be nice if I had a tank, but. Other units can suffice too. Gonna bring Zyga up. Check this out. He's the star of the show here. All right, other tanks gonna start rolling up probably, so we have to be careful. Yeah, it's not good. Simon is exactly the kind of character you play in every shooter game. Just run into an enemy all trigger hack be screaming like a madman. Exactly. Alright, you've got one shot, right. Connor. Right. Let's kill that um shock trooper in the back, probably. Actually, no, let's, let's kill the one closer to Simon right now. Or Zyga. Which is you? No, you. Yeah, here we go. You let your guard down. A bit anticlimactic. I can play support. I figured them out. I can play support. Yeah, same. I only play support. Yeah, let's just, uh, let's just, uh, charge in, shall we? Should we see if I can kill that sniper first? Hold on. Can I do this? So, chat, you know what I was watching before the stream? This new amazing Twitch channel I found? I'll link it in a second. This amazing Twitch channel. Oh, move, 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 move. Is it my channel? Because he's here's a you hear he's a pretty cool guy. Oh, thank you. But it's called Dash Ducks. Twitch.tv slash dash ducks. Um I, I I think it might be too dark now, uh, over in Mountain Time, but what you can do with that channel is you can donate bits or you can just wait for other people to donate as well, which is which I suggest. Don't don't make don't go broke people. But you can donate like 50 um, bits or 50 cents through other payment methods and feed ducks. It's that simple. They have night camera? Oh boy. Oh man. But yeah, just donate and feed ducks from the comfort of your home. Don't have to go out into like negative 10 degree weather and just chill, you know? Just chill. Chill with some Duxus. Now that is a Lugendorf's channel. That is a Lugendorf's channel right there. It, it's so therapeutic, yeah, seriously. It's very relaxing. Understood. 
I'm gonna kill this guy of psych. Ah! Let's kill both of these guys if we can. Can I? Let's see. It's gonna be close. There! Nah, not gonna work. And hide behind this wall. There we go. Are you guys feeding the ducks? I'm, I'm glad. I'm very glad. Oh, let's kill this guy. Why not? I don't give a damn! Alright, dude. Ah, oh, shoot. I'm too far away, actually. Crap. Uh, the food they're um, feeding are mealworms, I think. They have like a chicken camp too, if you're interested in those floofy boys. Right, you're coming up, aren't you? Yeah! You made a mistake there, buddy. Alright, we're good, I think. Let's head on in. You do the honor, Zyga. Hey, Raz, check this out. Hey, Raz. Anyone here? Uh oh. <sighs> Feels good. Man, a nice <laughs> hot sun. What the hell? <laughs> Walls. Lieutenant Colonel Bolt! Get out of the freaking shower, man! Come on! Get out! Enemies? <laughs> I thought I heard things getting hot and heavy. You'd better have a damn good reason why no one told me. Well, sir, it was just a few foot soldiers. We thought we could handle them on our own. Oh, really? It doesn't look to me like you've handled shit. <laughs> oh, come on! You didn't notice who it is? They're from the squad that sets my heart aflame. My soulmates. My soulmates. Oh. I don't know what they're doing out here without a tank. But I'm glad I just freshened up. If they're inviting us out on a date, I won't say no to a little fun. So he's gonna deploy now, looks like. Oh boy, uh-oh. Uh, let's see, hold on. Oh no! Oh no! There he is! <laughs> there he is! Okay. We're gonna need our Lancer. Something's not right. The enemy's moving in sync. Oh lord, he coming! Oh, no, it's that giant tank! Their commander's here! That explains it. Evidently, a little leadership goes a long way. Cut the commentary, we gotta move! Crap, it's like we're fighting a whole new squad! Well, if it isn't the big boss himself! Yappa! Now that's the way I like it! Big boss! Simon, stop! That tank is too powerful! There's no way we can handle it on our own! We've got no choice but to fall back. Everyone secure an escape route. Now! Alright, so we gotta head back now, huh? Three infantry units uh, reaches the target. Okay, but do we still have to capture the camp? No, oh, no, we don't. It was a Jape objective. All right, well, it's time for the uh, the fast movers to get out here. Let's see some spirit. That tank's gonna move fast, though. I have to be, I have to be faster than him, though. Speaking of ducks, um, I posted it in the Discord, but I'll show you guys in a second. I did go to the local pond and saw some pretty neat new ones that I haven't seen before. I'll knock them down. I have to look up what they're called again because I, I forgot already. 
Oh, shit. Okay. Yes, enemy down. Yes. Yeah, so here's one of them. Uh, these are the ones you've probably seen before if you've uh, been to the stream uh, a while back. So these guys are, of course, the Hooded Mergancers, the uh, male and female here. The fancy-headed ones, the fan heads, I call them. And they're just chilling off a of mallard here, you know? Regular old mallard. These guys are... New, actually. I think these are the ring crested ducks, I think, or the ring necked ducks. These are uh, orangized, uh, kind of black and white fellas. They're very fancy. They are good boys, yeah. Ring neck, thank you, Natalie, yeah. And you, you do notice that there's snow in the picture, and I, <laughs> I went out like a few days ago in the snow and freezing temperatures just to get. Check out the pond, you know? I was like, oh, maybe, uh... Maybe there won't be ducks at the pond because it's 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 too cold. But, no, we got a treasure trove here. So yeah, these are the ring-necked ones. And, you know, look at, look at them swimmy. Look at them. Let me uh, zoom out, actually. Here we go. This is actually a very nice shot. I like this one a lot. Just the blur of the, the snow and stuff. Now these guys, these guys are sharp, and not just because of their beaks, because their their beaks are pretty sharp. These are the um, I'm gonna need a reminder on this one. The something backs, I think. What were they called? Hold on, hold on. These were the uh. The canvas backs, yes. The canvas backs. They're sort of like, uh... They've got a bit of red on their uh, heads there. Also, I just turned off uh, streamer mode. Hold on. There we go. These are all very good ducks. I can't... I, I need to go to, um... There's a larger pond near a commercial area near me that I need to go to at some point because uh, those might have some good ones as well. And kind of the reason why we're seeing these uh, more diverse ducks, I think, is because these guys come around this area during the winter, during like the non-breeding season, just to chill, I think. So I think that's the reason why. Okay, uh... For now, though, let's <laughs> let's stop looking at ducks, Squad E, and uh, let's focus on the mission here. You know, I consider you guys like a like <laughs> kind of part of this game, like a, 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 whole, a whole separate squad. I can imagine you guys like being like distinct squad members for your own potentials and stuff. There should be like a, uh, there should be like a, uh, Valkyria, like, character creator, something like that. That'd be fun. I, I, I haven't, th I haven't thought about, like, all of you individually, like, for your classes. I guess you can assign yourself if you want. Squad D for ducks and degenerates. Fair enough, guys, fair enough. Alright, Azusa. Nice hair, by the way. Barvesta is literally a tank. Literal tank. <laughs> Damn it, either. So you, you can get fucked by walls. Yep. Yep. Let's keep moving. Understandable. Have a nice day. I think for myself, I'd probably be an engineer since, you know, support classes and all, you know. I like them support classes. Mm -hmm. No problem. There you are. Oh shit, okay, hold on. 
sneaky little scout here. Here I go. All right, that's guy's gonna be a problem now. I can't advance. There are barriers blocking my exit there. I'm gonna need an explosive for those. Can uh, Grenadier reach? Probably not. Maybe you move. Hold on. Inspiration strikes. Looks like my time's a shot. I figured them out. Sniper class, nice. Bun will be the good pupper. Good. Bun will be the uh, the mascot. You let your guard down. Hey, there will be the grand deer. Sounds good. Sounds good. I'm liking this. And then we'll have a duck as a literal Valkyria. A duck with Valkyria powers. <laughs> Barriers. Can't see him, so never mind. All right, Walls, what do you got? How fast is your tank here? Well, well. well, well. Oh God, uh, it's really fast. You're, you're going pretty far there, son. Burn him down. Uh, what? Excuse me? Oh no. Oh god. You! Whoa. Yeah, I'm, I'm not sure what Wallace is doing there. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. Reinforcements, huh? Can I take his camp? Hold on. I wanna see what happens if I take his camp. Will I do anything? Oh crap! Monka S is a uh, a global emote. Nice, excellent. That's good to hear. Understood. That's very good to hear. That means another slot for Nep dancing emotes. Okay. Enemy spotted. Okay then. All right. Okay. Let's go. Hey Walls, you left your uh your light you left your back door open. Just saying. Hey yes, check this out. Victor condition? It looks like it is. Oh, it's not. Okay. Huh. Uh. Okay. Yeah. So it, it, it played the victory theme, but we didn't win. <laughs> Just got japed there, I guess. Understood. I smell blood. Okay. All right. Oh no. All right. Should we just shoot them? Hold on. What am I doing? Bye. Yeah, base camps are probably hard coded to play that. That's true. The whole fanfare, you know. Let's see some spirit. Can you reach the end here, Hannah? I'm hoping you can. Maybe? Maybe you can. Let's see some spirit. Talk 
Oh, you sure can. You sure can. Bye. There. Oh. How did you miss that? How did you miss that? What the? Whoa. How did you miss that? How did you miss that? My pleasure. Yeah, XCOM flashbacks. God. I gotta try it again. I'm not happy with this. Let's see some spirit. Let's see you like actually hit the shot. Oh, 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 oh my god. Oh my god. Too slow. What's up, Max Wedgie? From now on, when someone says they're playing D&D &D and responding with Ducks and Degenerates? Oh yeah, that's fit. Nice. How you doing? Welcome. Alright, we gotta finish the mission here, so... Let us kill this fella first. This good fella here. Don't talk. Let's keep moving. Do you have like one part of your hair shorter than the other? Yeah, the game's messing with me. It knows I'm too powerful. We've secured an escape route. Now's our chance. Rags! This way! The enemy's retreating! Engaging pursuit! You don't have a camp! You can't! No. We can equip while we're ahead. But, sir! This was supposed to be some R&R &R before our next big op. No need to tire ourselves out while we're off the clock. Besides, our princess and her knight should be getting back from their walk. I'm not so tactless as to greet a lady with gunfire. Let's hit the showers and await her grand return. Nice! And yeah, after every mission now, including skirmishes, you get these renown points that you can spend in the infirmary for uh, different unlocks and stuff. Oh, this is a long one. Okay, nice. Maybe another mission in this one. Is the right word, but we didn't lose either. More importantly, we managed to save Ragnarok. I'd call that a successful rescue mission. <laughs> Darn right! Huh? Wait a sec. Where'd Rags go? Oh no! Why is no one keeping an eye on this dog? What is happening? Why are you so irresponsible? Hmm. That's weird. I I could have sworn he was just here. Everyone over there. <laughs> meat. Uh oh. The doggos meet. They fight over meat. Oh shit! That wolf's trying to take Rax's meat. There's no way he can stand up to that beast. What do we do? I can handle this. What? You didn't shoot it? You should have just killed the damn thing. Well, it just doesn't feel right. A warning shot that only grazed its fur. Nicely done. Come on, Rags. Hurry up and get over here. We need to report back now, before we miss the boat. Uh-oh. 
What's that rumbling sound? Oh no! Oh, you poor thing. So these wicked humans tried to hurt you, did they? We got the mess of her now? Oh jeez. <laughs> what the goddamn is that? This blizzard. That woman. It's the Winter Witch! This is not good. This is untenable. Fenrir did nothing wrong. How dare you point your gun at him? I will grant you no mercy! Protect the Yardago. It's admirable. Die, fools! Your very name shall be erased from history! Don't touch my doggo! Oh no, okay. Oh, this is gonna suck. Oh boy. This is going to suck. Snowball fight, what? What luck we have to run into the Winter Witch here of all places. Alright, so this is big map again. I'm sure you all know by now, but our attacks aren't going to do squat against her. We need to concentrate more on finding a chance to escape alive than trying to take her down. We need to brace against her attacks and try to secure an escape route. We have to hurry back to the ship or they're going to leave without us at this rate. Alright, so four units have to reach the target here. Gotcha. Which looks like it's in the, um, the south, uh, this. something. Awaiting further orders. Ready and waiting. Now we only have three fast units here, so we are a bit bottlenecked in that regard. Ready and waiting. Can't wait! Here I go. Got to stay calm. Let's do this. Hmm. All right. Um, let me change my, uh... Can I change my loadout? Doesn't look like I can, actually. Huh. I don't plan on dying just yet. Come on, everyone. We can do this. Oh, boy. The red cone this of death. Bad. Real bad. Guys, we gotta run. We can't. That blizzard is blocking our escape. Then we need to return fire. Hold out, everyone. It's do or die. Okay. So, oh, oh no. Oh my god. Okay, so let's not panic here. Let's not panic. And first point out that there appears to be a little bit of a shortcut down here. Down into the objective. So that's important. That'll prevent us from going head on against the witch here. So let's ignore all of this down here. All of this down here. Now up here. Um... Obviously, it'll be good to take the camp, just in case. This camp right here. Um, we're gonna have to deal with all these units, though, and... Tank should be easy. Two shots from a Lancer. Otherwise, we just gotta scatter, kill these guys. This is a Gatling, probably. Yes, so we'll have to take care of him as well. Fortunately, he's pointing upwards, which is not very smart. So, we can just kind of ignore him. There is another shortcut to the south, that's correct. But that does funnel us into the Cone of Fire here, just next to the Winter Witch. That's another problem. And over here as well, yeah. Over here. Now, I don't think these are walls though, these crevices. So we still might get shot at, but it, it's a good way to uh, just avoid direct fire. Okay, so let us save. And let's go ahead and scout things out for a second. Alright, there actually are a bit of some walls, yeah. Okay. 
Grenadier laying fire on me. Damn it. Stay off range for a sec. Man, if only we had a tank. If only. Let's keep moving. I wish we had a tank. All right, four units, but we should move our entire. Uh, we can't. We can't open up this entire base camp, though. That's the thing. We can't because there's this guy down here who's gonna start charging toward us in the to the uh, the south here. Hey, Pip! Thanks for the host. Let me give you a shout out. Proto Pip. There we go. How you doing? Hope your uh, stream went well. What's up, Nova Sis? How you doing? Oh, hi yo. All right, um, I'm going to probably take Hannah and kill this tank and then have her guard against the south here. Let's see some spirit. Mind. Some school spirit. No, no. Oh shit, uh oh. Okay, I'm hoping you can hit from this far because that's all I'm willing to let you go right now. Oh, good job. We got our uh, side squad here and facing this winter witch fella, of course. You always gotta be the winter witch, always. Can I do this? Hey, kill this grand deer for me, will ya? I'm getting nervous. Are, are, are you serious right now? Niche, please. But relatable, so I, that's I, that's understandable. I forgive her. Nova Sis, these games are pretty long. These are probably the longest games I've streamed on this channel. Um, the first and the fourth one here separately. Oh, great. Yeah, get up. At least 60 hours. My save file right now is around 60 hours. Oh fuck. This is turn-based and is also like a strategy game. It's a turn-based strategy game with like third-person shooter elements, pretty much. It's very interesting. It's a sort of genre mix I haven't seen done before. My brain calms me down. But again, there are four main games in this series. The first and the fourth one are probably the best ones. Don't miss. Ooh, good job. Good job. A strategy based shooter, yeah. Kinda like XCOM, but kinda not, you know? Kinda not. It's one of those games where you just kinda have to, like, watch slash play it yourself to see how, uh, to see how genius it is, really. We need some support up here. Um, I might pull Azusa to the north here, just for a bit more protection. I don't want her standing out in the open here. I actually might line up a lot of people on the north here. That might be better. Understood. Get out of here, scout. Oh my god, Azusa, please! It's nothing. You got the headshot and you screwed it up! They smell blood. Alright, we gotta get you some help. Let's send uh, Simon up there. Start, stop laughing, dude.
You know what? I think the laughing gives him power. Keep going. Continue. Um, shit. <laughs> yeah, Photon, yeah. Freaking Aaron Ryan, oh my god. I'm gonna pull back, I think. Let me see if I can kill that scout first. But I'm, I'm not confident in a push right now. Oh god! Oh no! Alright. Okay, alright, alright, alright. Let's keep moving. Alright, get out of here. All right, not, not that much of an offensive first round, but I got some important units out of the way, so we should be better for the next ones. All right, here we go. Oh, no. She's about to freaking grenade our troops here. I'm afraid not. God. I'll never lose faith. I was chosen. Stop! Stop! Stop right now! Don't you dare kill Zyga! Okay, that's gonna miss, I think. That's gonna miss. Yeah, we're undercover, so we're good. This tank might pose a few problems. Oh, jeez. Oh, no. Oh, no. Thank goodness. Please hit. Ah, oh, good try. All right, lines are coming up. do nothing huh okay oh crap uh right there was a tank down there right oh this is a big yikes we are under the blizzard here which is gonna be a huge problem oh no all right I'm gonna make it separate safe here Yikes, yikes, yikes. Um, big yikes. Can I do this? Oh, get the heck out of here. Please hit. I, um, <laughs> uh, what was the timing there? What? What was that timing? What? She she hit the target. And it's like and then she was like, nah, nah, I'm good, I'm good. Can I do this? I'll be trying to disable crime. Can I disable crime area? Oh fuck. Uh oh. No, it's not like the um, it's not like the end game here. I can't disable that uh that thingy. Oh my god! Is that the enemy? Oh my god, Niche! That's not good! That is not good! Right now, Rita. There. Damn it! Oh. 
crap. That's not good. That's our healer down. We'll have to redeploy her. I don't want to die. I should have sent her around the back. Dang it. I should have sent her around the back. Okay. No problem. Come on, get her, please. I know a sinner when I see one. Be gone. All right, good, 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 good. Okay, we're out of range. Oh my god. Oh, oh, oh my gosh. Oh. Oh my god. All right. Crimea is so terrifying. Yeah, we gotta send people around the back here or something. Yo, I've gotta move these again. She's not under the cover here. Which is not good. There we go. That's better. You can kill this Lancer, too. Yeah. <laughs> As if she's going to. Yeah. She did, though. That's good. That potential procs so often. I hate it. Oh, right. Yeah, it takes one turn. Okay. I got to, I got to keep Zyga Understood. in the camp. I got to defend here. Oh, the sandbags aren't up either. Crap. All right. This should be fine. All right. Let's take a bit of a move over here. Um, everything's going to put us in range. My pleasure. Okay, Rosetta, I gotta get you undercover here. I'm Perfect. There we go. Uh. Thank goodness. All right, I think we're all undercover, ah. so Crimea shouldn't be able to do anything to us. Let's hope, though. Let us let us pray. Okay, good. Yeah, we're fine. We're fine. I'll make you suffer. It ain't gonna work, lady. There. Guy's moving up. If he moves close enough, I should be able to take him out pretty easily by sending the Lancer behind him. Oh no! Oh no! Oh! oh! You have a flamethrower! Oh, you have a flamethrower! Okay. Okay, I'm gonna try to kill that tank because if that tank doesn't die, that's a pr that's a big problem, a massive problem right now. A Crimea, God, you're gonna be a pain, aren't you? Oh, Hannah's it will help too. Please, Connor doesn't have the anti-armor rounds. Do you? No, you don't. Oh no. Oh no. Huh? 
run, 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 run. You on second, huh? Okay, that's cool, but run. Didn't even break a sweat. Be gone. It worked out. It worked out. Gotta move her again, though. Because, uh... Let's see some spirit! Cover. Yeah. Don't die! Huh? Alright. So that tank's down. That's, just, that's pretty good. Um... Yo, let's take this ca- I should have I shouldn't have deployed the engineer there. I should have deployed her here. But I can evac her next turn. Uh, let's take this camp. Rosetta... God, the scouts are like... Fucked with HP here. Jesus. There. Found you! Meat sack. I'm not gonna hit. Are you serious? Alright. My pleasure. Please don't notice Crimea Chan. Enemy base occupied. Why, Chen? Actions speak louder than words. <laughs> Kwai Maria, yeah. May you rest in peace. I mean, she's like literally always crying. Like she's got tears in her eyes because of uh. I refuse to submit. Her troubles, let's just say. <laughs> now, can Azusa hit five body shots? Let's see. Five. All right. Cool. Good job. Oh, fuck. Um. Oh, that's that's cool. That's cool. Guess I'm redeploying the Lancer after I killed his tank. Guess that's happening. Here I come! God, damn it. <laughs> damn it. Ah, uh, fine, 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 fine. You wanna play it this way, game? I'll play it offensively, I'll show you. Okay, I'm hoping this tank moves up next turn. So I can shoot, shoot, retreat, and redeploy this, uh... My Lancer here. For now, though, um... Let's end the turn. I was chosen. Yeah, you're not gonna do anything, are you? There. I'm going to fight against you, Crimea. I know your tricks. I was chosen. Your Twix. Be gone. <sighs> All right, tanks coming up. Good. That's what I wanted. All right, good, good, good. Now the problem is, Cremaria. That's the problem, so I'm gonna save again. 
I'm gonna try to distract her, maybe. Make her turn your way a bit. Also, did you guys see this? Um. Hold on. First of all, I found this image from like years back from the um <laughs> the past Power Vortex. Back when Sharknado was a thing, right? You guys remember that? R remember when that remember when that was a thing? The freaking Sharknado movies? Are they still making those? I swear to god, hold on. Are they still making those? Oh my god, yeah. The last Shark Data was released in August 19th, 2018. They really uh, banked on that franchise, huh? Yeah. But this was made um back in the last poor Vortex in the US. I forgot, I forgot when that was. That was uh, a while back, but... Interesting to see how those... Uh... Direct to TV movie franchises go. I haven't seen any of those movies, by the way, and the Sharknado ones. I kind of don't want to. Knock them down. It, it probably won't be worth my time. There. Found them. Huh? I think Hannah could stay yeah. here. Uh, I risk at the uh Despite the risk from the the uh, shock trooper back there. The movies are surprisingly self-aware, I see. Enjoy the foods, bun. There. Found them. Enemy spotted. Oh, we have to redeploy her. Actually, the tank. The uh, not the tank. The the lancer. There we go. We really can't do much until we've got her, so let's just hold out here. Here I go. That doesn't work on me. That that sounds that sounds interesting, Photon. Enemy spotted. God. I'm really not a movie buff. Some of you know this. Like, I've, I've been to the movies like once in the past year, I think. Just in general. Oh, I'm not talking about Sharknado movies, just in general movies. Movies that are actually good, Be that gone. sort of thing. Tank, time to meet your maker. Found them. There they are. There they are. Time to meet your maker and your baker. There. Found them. Kubo and the two strings. I don't think I've seen that actually. Let's see some spirit. There's a few Ghibli ones I still need to watch, oh, I think. 
Are these things like all turning their backs? Are you serious? There they are. Oh god, okay. I guess, the I guess the next movie I'll watch is the Sonic movie, you know. How do you know Detective Pikachu? <laughs> Screw the Sonic movie. I've got work to do. Now Detective Pikachu looks good. I'm excited for more information from that one. I know a sinner when I see one. Can't wait to see Sonic's bare feet, haha. Uh -huh. Ah. Thank goodness. Here we are. <laughs> what, Chad? What? Nothing to be concerned about. You got something to hide, Azusa, don't you? Are you a spy? I'm afraid not. Hey. All in a day's work. <laughs> no spies here. God. Yeah, I get um. Work at some more channel specific emotes, honestly. I've been slacking a bit on that. If only Twitch would give me some more uh, slots, I would have a bit more motivation. we have left um i think we can beat this this turn uh let's see if we can get hannah oh maybe not shit hannah please yeah she's not making it beans my pleasure Thank goodness. Time to get me the partner. That's a long way out, but thank you. Here we are. You can't get what you can't see. The target's only here, huh? Oh, oh no. My poor Fenrir. I'll never let anyone hurt you again. I will show them the fear oh, no. they made you feel. No. Tenfold. No. Do not charge up. Do not. Do not power up. You're not. Let's keep moving. She's powering up those crystals. Gotta watch out here. Can you make it, Hannah? Let's see. She's fighting for a noble cause, though. Protecting your loyal uh, doggo. Hey, are her spells getting weaker or is it just me? It's almost as if she's running out of mana. Running out of mana? Ha! <laughs> ah, meta. Meta? I don't know. Fine. Still a nerd. Then we'll push her back while we still can.
Magic missile. Let's see some spirit. Hannah, please. Let's see some spirit. Hannah, please. You're just outside the range! You're just outside! Come on! I was chosen. Don't turn around. Do not turn around. Okay, good. Huh? I'll make you suffer. Oh, I'm about to take a nap while this uh, happens. Don't mind me. Do your worst, Primaria. Let's see some spirit. Boom. Not an A rank, okay? Huh? Yeah, I definitely could have done that faster. I think. Yeah, she's effective, as people call her. Feels bad. She looks like she's in pain. That magic isn't meant for mortals. I don't think the human body can handle all that power. So why did it, why did noise not play? Hold on. Easy peasy. There we go. B rank, yeah, probably one turn earlier and it would've been good. Dang it! Freaking a Lancer! I'm kinda of surprised that um stream elements haven't hasn't broken on me more often. It is quite a good uh framework they have there. Oh boy, how So you can put up a fight, but this isn't over yet. You'll pay for what you did to Fenrir. Are we gonna have another battle? You, you got it all wrong. We were only trying to protect our friend. Your friend? Friend. Yes, this good, good boy right here. Oh. 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 A Federation rescue dog? Huh, now that's a surprise. Just a minute ago, they were at each other's throats. What's up, Munchie? How you doing? Yeah, it's strange, but I guess they're friends now. Wow, they're even sharing meat. Yes, I, I said they I said they shouldn't be friends. Yes, I'm so glad this is happening. <sighs> I appreciate him sharing his food. Tell him that for me, will you? Oh, of course. He's a real smart boy, so I'm sure he'll understand. On Fenrir's behalf, I'll let you off this once. But don't think you'll be so lucky next time. Good, Come, doggos. Good. Not only did we disembark without permission, but we engaged an enemy officer. If the higher-ups find out... Perhaps we'll be court-martialed. Ah! But that would make an excellent episode for my novel. Oh my god. Not another word. You'd either be writing behind bars or in front of a firing squad. We better get our story straight. Stories, huh? <laughs> Don't say that word, Azusa! Don't say it! <laughs> Alibis? Good idea. Explain all this. Uh, um, picnic. Why don't we all say we went on a picnic? Because uh, the weather was so nice. Oh, your precious niche. 
nice weather. Is that what you call a friggin' blizzard? <laughs> Whatever, let's just roll with it. We went out for a picnic and had a nice long snowball fight. It's as good a story as any. <laughs> right you are. One of the most thrilling snowball fights of my life, that's for sure. Are, are, are they actually going with this? Are, are they actually? Yeah, I guess we can go with that. Sucks that I got a lie to Raz about it, though. Oh, whatever, man. Okay, guys, we're all gonna take this secret to our graves. Let's swear on it. Oh, that, that line coming from you? Oh. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. Copy that. I'll die before I spill the beans on this one. Then it's a promise. All right, now let's hustle. We still need to make it back before the ship leaves. Come on, Rags. I'll fix you up a feast when we get there. <laughs> oh, damn it. Damn it. So you were gone all this time for a picnic. Yeah, Claude. I mean, just, just believe us, man. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> you goddamn idiots! Morgan would have set off ages ago if you weren't playing hooky! And if Claude hadn't been begging the captain to stay, we might not have waited at all. We are very, very sorry about all of this. We just got a little carried away with our snowball fight. Yep, and what a snowball fight it was! Felt like I was back home being a kid again. I can't believe even you got mixed up in the stupidity. <laughs> and what's gotten into you, Rags? This isn't like you. I hope you've learned your lesson, boy. Good boy. Well, what's done is done. I expect a full report later. Now, let's head to the mess hall while dinner is still nice and hot. Oh, what a relief. My hands and feet are basically chunks of ice at this point. Sheesh. All right, everyone. Let's go. Ah, Claude. You're too nice. Crap. Um. Take down all the aces in a sloop of bars and snowball fights to unlock a new episode. You've got this. Great. Um. Great. Great. Of course the game would pull that on me. They did have the last DLC too. Of course. Although I didn't see the aces. I didn't see them. So I've got a bit of work to do for the next stream. Um, I'm gonna almost finish the final fight on hard mode and I'm also gonna get all the aces in here so we can see the last cutscenes for the Captionist Squad uh, DLC. Now, um, before I do go, uh, let me head to headquarters and level up a bit. Also, let me write this all down because I'm gonna forget. Uh, so I get all the aces. And chapter 18, final fight. Finish. Almost finish hard mode. Finish on stream. There we go. Okay. I will check the potentials, yes, for uh, Rally and Claude. Okay, let's see. Welcome back, bud. Uh, we finished the combat and they sort of uh, had to make a little excuse just for leaving the ship so long. So. Also, Rags and Fenrir are not friends, yeah. But we have to. Um, like the beach DLC, you have to go back to those two missions and f kill all the aces to unlock the, um, I guess the true ending of that side story. So I'm, I'm gonna have to do that off stream for next time. Okay, so let's see here. Uh, right, Claude is in the, wherever the hell it was, the equipment section. All right, so we've got, let's see. Uh, Oral Vow. His promise to Riley increases all his stats. And Riley... 
Her promise to Claude increases all her stats. Okay. Simple as that. That's all you need. There. All set for the next battle. Alright, cool. So, uh, let's head to the training field, etc, etc. Now, the costs are getting expensive for these, for these Paragon units. <laughs> Freaking 50k. I barely even have that much. So it's real grinding hours now. Don't get careless, everyone. Nicely done. Done. I basically blew all my money last time. Yeah, I don't have a lot. Jesus. Can we even buy anything right now? Oh, hey, Claude. I think we need to develop some more ship parts, right? Yeah, a little bit, I guess. Wow. Wait, why am I upgrading this? I don't have to. I don't have to ship in either of those missions. Hold on. The max level I think is 30. Um, the max before the end game was 20, I believe, and I had to buy an infirmary upgrade to boost it. So yeah, I've got, I've got a bit of a way to go with that one. Yeah, I, I really gotta start playing those skirmishes. Just grind out some more money here. Cause I'm freaking out already. <laughs> Jesus. For some more Karen. Welcome. What can I do for you today? Alright, can't get anything? Uh, let's see here. Still, we can't. I think we need to, like, buy these four things to get random weapons from, um... Like, random Imperial weapons or something? I don't know, but... I want to get all these unlocks first before I, uh... Get these, like, temporary ones, I think. Or these repeatable ones. Well, I've got most of the important ones. The, uh, level cap increase for all the... The ranks, or the... I'm blanking here. Uh... The level cap increase for all of the different classes. Type upgrades. I'm kind of surprised there isn't an up... Well, yeah, there's no upgrade for the, uh... There's not even an upgrade tree for the Hoffman, so we can't even buy an upgrade for that one, which kind of sucks. Done already. Well, come back anytime you need some help. I'm letting Karen get in some more lines since we, we we need to hear more of her. Cute medic. Cute medic. But yeah, for someone who was asking earlier, um, I have fifth, I have 63 hours in this game, 64 actually, getting up there. So. It is quite long. What's up, Vine Lore? How you doing? Um, you, you're kind of catching me on the tail end here, so I apologize. But for next time, uh, we are going to again. I'll finish those the DLC task and the final fight, and we'll see. I think I'm assuming the ending changes if I if I beat level 18 that that final battle on hard, given the events prior. But I guess we'll see together once we get to that. You're alright? Nice, nice. But, um... Other than that, we also have this... Episode. Extra story. The two Valkyria. For fans of... Selvaria, we'll see her again, um... Probably next stream. I'll do this next stream, probably. Selvaria and Crimeria serve sort of their, uh, I guess their rivalry of some sort. And also, we've got a whole bunch of other, uh, squad stories to do. Uh, which ones have I done? I don't even remember. Oh yeah, this is the one with, uh, <laughs> with the dude here. Crazy man. If I have time, I'll do this. Whenever I'm doing squad stories, I'll probably do this one first. So, um... 
Yeah, uh... I I'm kind of thinking about how to balance all of this, because I, I... You know what? It's fine if I do squad stories, like a bunch of squad stories in a row. That's fine, that's fine. Yeah, Simon, Simon. Yep, yep. Oh, and uh, next time I may... I may play in Japanese for a second, because, um... That'd be kind of nice, actually. I know some of you are fans of the Japanese voice acting, of course. You love these streams? Well, I love seeing everyone here. Thanks for coming, guys. Thank you. Yeah, the side stories are honestly my, some of my favorite stuff in this game. Just a bit of a break from all the, uh, the heavy plot stuff, so... Yeah, um, I'm gonna see when I want to stream this next. Um... This has kind of got me wanting to play it a bit earlier than I anticipated, so... I may shift my schedule around, just to account for that. So, I would think, um... Let's see, let's see. Uh, let's see. I'll probably stream this next on Sunday. I think that sounds good. Just a little bit more of this. I was originally planning to play Wargroove, but I, I kind of don't want to pair like these similar-ish strategy games with each other. So after I finish this game, I'll probably play Wargroove um, afterwards. Just check it out a bit. Which, by the way, Wargroove comes out like in two days, I think, on the first. So I'll, I'll probably be playing that a bit of that offline just beforehand. So. Yeah, yeah, thanks for coming, guys. Let me see who's live. Um, tomorrow, I think I'm gonna stream, um... What the hell did I write down? Yeah, well, let me get to the uh, host here, hold on. Alright, Desert's live, uh... You said Bun Time's live? I don't see her live right now. Am I not following her? Oh, she is still not fine. Okay. Uh, let's see here. Yeah, let's let's uh, host Desert. He's playing uh, Resident Evil 2. He's raided me a whole bunch of times before, so let's go ahead and raid him back. You're online, Arvesta. Okay, so for tomorrow, I think I had... Oh yeah, tomorrow is Twitch integrated um, game streams, which will include Cluster Truck and Clone Drone in the Danger Zone, which I streamed last time, like a few months back. So, if you want to try to screw me over in some games, come by tomorrow around the same time. It's going to be fun. Alright, thanks for coming, guys. I'll see you guys later. Stick around for the raid, and have a good night.